We haven't had very many pool days. Hopefully that's going to change. Today's actually pretty nice. Yeah, today is not the greatest day for a pool day, but it's not bad either. Uh, yesterday we had the clouds and we also had rain for the first half of the week. Uh, those temperatures today into the mid 80s. I know it's uh, not what is uh, ideal for the summertime, but uh, those temperatures outside are much warmer than they were yesterday. We were into the 70s yesterday, 80s today, 13 degrees warmer than 24 hours ago. And we do have the sun out there as we went through the uh, evening hours. Jeff Schmidt uh, Auto Group camera did not uh, load there, but look at that wind speeds right now as we look outside out of the east at around 16 miles per hour, and we do have that sunshine here through the Miami Valley. Now, as we go into your day tomorrow, we will start off with some mostly cloudy skies. Overnight, we'll see those clouds increase here through the Miami Valley as we do have a low developing down into the southern half of the United States. And as we go through your day tomorrow, it's going to be uh, just a bit cooler into the 70s, and we have those cloud uh, those cloudy conditions through much of the daytime and then the chances of rain arrive here as we go to the uh, five and six o'clock hour just in time for the work commute home. Live Doppler 2 HD. We are staying dry here in the Miami Valley. It's been a quite a different picture than f the last 48 hours. And as I mentioned, we do have a low that's forming down to the south here right at the moment, and that is where it is. And over the next 48 hours, it'll continue to deepen as it makes its way up to the northeast. And that's when we'll see those chances of showers and thunderstorms as we head into the second half of the week. Right now, high pressure is dominating just to the north of us in a part, uh, parts of Canada. Outside right now, we do have uh, just a few clouds, a little bit more clouds uh, here than actually outside. 83 degrees is the temperature. Dew point at 55, so not as humid today. And we do have temperatures into the mid 80s up to the north in Wapakoneta at 85 degrees, 81 Springfield and Xenia, 83 in Detroit and Dayton. Now, as we go to the evening hours, we'll see those clouds start to pick on up here. We could even see a stray shower as we go into the middle portion of the nighttime. Just going to be a stray chance here and we'll see those cloudy conditions as we go in the morning hours. This model picks up on a very brief shower, but I think we do stay dry in the morning. Eventually, though, in the evening hours will be cloudy and those showers do start to make their way here into the Miami Valley. We're not expecting heavy rainfall, but it's going to be persistent through the nighttime and it's going to be that annoying rain. Thankfully overnight it will be uh, ma mainly it will be into the overnight hours and then going into your Friday. More chances of showers as we head into your weekend tonight. 60 degrees for the low, a stray shower, partly cloudy, and then we get up to 77 tomorrow. It will be a cloudy day. Winds upwards of 15 miles per hour over the next seven days. Those temperatures are looking up as we head into your weekend, starting off a little bit cooler than normal, though, on Friday as we start in the mid 70s, getting up to 85 by Saturday, Sunday, 89 degrees. And then as we go into the work week, just a little bit cooler and still chances of showers and thunderstorms early on into the week.